and in day two we are proceeding with part two uh, continuing of refurbish of the battery pack on Tesla S85 there were four damaged blocks and one block was almost beyond repair but we succeeded with the repair some of the fuses were damaged and BNB was beyond repair we, we need to change it, we already had one refurbished we did repair on C27, C26 and few fuses were blown this was completely repaired and now we can check uh, voltage level of all cells cell from cell 0 to six, uh, cell uh, 6 and delta is 3 millivolts which is great total voltage of the block is 23.334 uh, this means uh, block wasn't discharged uh, when it was submerged in water uh, because customer arrived on time now let's go to prepare battery pack for cleaning and assembly Step one, clean all the surface from all the glue and clean it and we need to prepare it for assembly. Step two, assembling everything back, putting back the battery box. And this is S85, Master BMS. Me, we almost finished with the step two, uh, assembling the battery pack. Third step is to clean uh, error logs in DMS processor, Texas Instruments. Uh, this is invasive method. It's not possible via CAN bus to erase F107. Now we will clean it manually. BMS finished, uh, now we can assemble it, uh, error locks erased, or error flags erased, and now it's ready for use, let's go assemble it. Step 4, testing a complete battery pack on the bench without uh, putting it on the car back, because we need to be sure be uh, before uh, gluing it back completely and assemble it completely. We will connect directly to all 16 BMBs with our tool, Crew BMS. Now, we see all 16 blocks, that means uh, everything is okay. Even if one, for example, if one uh, BMB is disconnected, we wouldn't have any communication with uh, battery pack first what we need to see how big delta is 8 millivolts is almost perfect uh, maximum allowed on this state of the charge it i think it's about about 45 millivolts uh, total battery pack voltage 373 this is okay Ooh.
Ya te puse mal. Now first test. We hear contactors. Now screen should be booting. Yeah, everything is okay. We have double click from contactors and pre-charge. Uh, this is probably successful operation. everything works we have start First everything seems okay no active alerts or DTCs or any kind of issues acceleration 280 kilowatts are working well Anyway, any, any, when we make any battery pack repair or any port in repair, we usually test the car at least 1000 kilometers because we need to see if there is any other issues. It's not always possible to repair battery pack at first attempt. It depends on how heavy the damage was and what was the problem before. And uh, in this case, uh, we, we not only made the repair, we made preventive repair to prevent the water ingress again and we hope this battery pack will last at least at least 200 kilometers more see you guys